Okay, this is good. This is good. Coral reefs are usually warmer. Here's some horses. Look at this coral reef. Holy shit. Oh my god. You seeing this shit? There's a bat taking off somewhere. A mine, mine cart. Mine cart. Hold up. You're telling me. Why would there be a mine cart roll somewhere around here? What is that? Squid swims, bat taken off. All right, we're getting we're getting warmer. We're getting warmer. This is good. But I want to know what in the world that is down there. Look at that. Something secret. The secret tool that will help us later. Yo, if I can get myself like what 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 was that? The conduit from vanilla? Oh good, what the fuck biome is this? What biome are we in now? From Coral Reef? Here, we'll sleep. What the hell biome is this? Is this like a fall? Because like the, the leaf colors don't change per season, right? So this is a forest, but it's a very specific forest. I love here. Oh, I can't I can't take off the debug menu. But ah, oh, that's so cool. Just gotta wait for this to not be tired anymore. And even then I have to wait even longer. To get further away from being tired. I am curious what this all is doing. It looks like it's getting rid of duplicated values. Huh. Which I guess would probably save on memory because if you're having two strings of the same value, you really shouldn't need to make two instances of the same string in memory. Which means it probably stores off that string as a, a constant somewhere or in a hash map somewhere or hash set somewhere. You just gotta want, it's gotta be an extra bit of processing, like CPU processing to help with memory management. That's the only thing I can think of for what this is doing. All right, I know I'm not tired anymore, but I wanna get this as farther away from being tired as I can. Okay, so we are in what biome? Orchard biome. What biome is an orchard biome? I mean, it looks like a hilly, grassy place with trees in it, which, yeah, that, that tracks. Hmm. More shaded gardens. Well, there's a big old crag in the ground here. Oh, it's a river. Huh. Oh, look at this big river. It's a shame that it doesn't show up on the map. 
Yeah, it's a shame that this doesn't show up on, on this map. That's where Journey Map would probably be better. Ooh, more pairs. Can't see garbage. Is that really the only one you're gonna give me? Out of all of those? Okay. Well, what an odd texture to use for the map, but I don't see... Yeah, I just, I just don't see it. I don't see... There's more mountains, even. I don't see anywhere in here that's... Uh, gonna become desert, so... We're gonna still have to keep our eyes peeled for things. Especially because I don't really have a whole lot of time left for today. I kinda gotta get going. Can you pick that up, please? Thank you. Yeah, I think these little berries, the the ones that aren't from Rustic, the these ones, five of plenty of ones, are very good for traveling, for just light, light traveling. Like, if I need to heal and get my saturation back up to allow me to heal, then obviously something better would be, something bigger would be better, but these... I've eaten them six times, and they're still just as good. And like they're, they fill up my uh, thirst bar as well. Like they're very good for just eating on the road. But anything that needs more, something more substantial, some something a little more hearty. Look at that! I'm already tired again. Like we just dealt with this. I think that's, yeah, that's nothing. Yeah, and unfortunately, I think this is going to be all one video if I'm doing 20 to 30 minutes. It's just going to be me exploring, which is going to be kind of boring. So we'll see what we can do about that. Come on. Nope, more trees. Oh. Oh, is it a jungle? <gasps> okay, this is good. This is good. Oh, what did we hit upon? Spalerite, that's fine. This is zinc. Just eat the berry. Eat the berry. Yeah, that's jungle, all right. Okay, so this is zinc deposit. We hit upon, is this Lavender Fields? Lavender Fields, oh that's so cool. Yo. That's so cool. <laughs> Got coal here. Pick up the lavender. That's fine. I'll say, what is this? Silty grass? Silty dirt? Ah, oh, more beach. Well, that was a cool biome. But yeah, let's go over here to the jungle and see if we can grab vanilla bamboo. For scaffolding? I think scaffolding exists in this, right? Yes, from Future MC, which needs vanilla bamboo. Yeah, yeah. I really only need it for scaffolding, but hey. You guys know me. 
And if you don't, go watch our shared hardcore series. Seriously, it's very good. Jack Aranda leaves. That's an interesting wood color. It's like a nice pink. It's going to give us the sapling for it. Do we have enough? We have enough space, I guess, for all three items. Should we take this? It's a nice pretty wood. Here, you know what? Here, here, here. If I can type, that would be lovely. I don't have a tree marker, so I'm just going to have to do the X. Which will probably get lost. Let's be real here. Bamboo. Now, is this vanilla bamboo? Tropicraft bamboo. What do you do? Bamboo mugs. Drop the craft book. You make a bamboo chest. Bamboo sticks. Flower pots. Huh. I love how there's also mooncap mushrooms here. Ooh, is this coconuts? It's papaya. Where'd it go? I right-clicked it. I wonder if it... Hmm. Oh, well, we're kind of sitting full now. Look how much lavender fields this thing just goes into. Jeez. <gasps> Is that a peacock? Hi, peacock. Here's more papaya. Fucking Zostig Zen again. What is this garbage? Okay, map, you're gonna have to not do that. Okay, so I have to left click those fruits to break them for some reason. Right clicking doesn't seem to work. But, oh well, I got papaya. I got the other kind of bamboo, which I don't really want, but hey. Orange. Take oranges for sure. Oh yeah. Give me them oranges. Why is there- wait, why is there a frost garden over here? Windies and tropical, I get. Frost? Sorry, that doesn't compute. <gasps> Grape seeds. Give. Give. Fuck off, bamboo. Give. Can I do anything with you? I can plant you, right? I've got to be able to plant you. If I can get grape trees... Hello, peacock. Peppercorns! Alright, alright, hang on. I don't really need the iron and copper. Sesame is new, I want that. Dried... get the fuck out of here. Dried plant fibers. No one cares. But peppercorns, hell yeah. If I can replant those, that'd be great. Yeah. Yeah, just make a peppercorn seed. And just plant my own. Amazing. Where are you? Peaches? 
Oh, it's an orange orange. Oh, it's a special one. What can I do with flower lavender? Lou just made purple dye. Seems kind of unnecessary when there's an entire forest or an entire field full of stuff. Hello, bees. How are you? Give me peaches. That I will want. Especially when I can make peach juice and peach smoothies. Give. This is where the scaffolding comes into play. Nah, I can't get it. That's fine. Oh, these are cocoa beans. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We need to come back here. If there's cocoa beans here... Oh yeah, there's plenty of jacaranda. So, actually... Oops. If I can't do anything with these, I might just drop those. Yeah, let's get rid of this. Because this whole area here... Lavender... And... And Jack and Ram the... And this little nub up here will have cocoa beans and all that. So this here... Jungle biome... Yeah, the big X, that's fine. Because then I can at least try and find those differently. Oh, screw you. You done? You done being sleep deprived? Hello, Peacock. Let's see what's up over this hill so we can see if we need to get going. Where are you? Teak tree. Oh, for teak wood. Papayas. Look at those holes in the ground. Okay. More tropical gardens. Game. We've got diorite even. Do we even need diorite for anything? I can't remember. Okay, I'm not seeing anything else really all that important. So I think we should probably just grab whatever we want left and just get out of here. I think that might be a lemon tree or something. Lemon or lime. Oh, melons! <gasps> there we go. Okay. Yeah, we're good now. If we've got melons coming our way. Hell yeah. This all jacaranda? Yeah, that's that's going to be a nice, interesting wood to deal with. To work with, I should say. Melons, melons, melons. Awesome. I was hoping for actual, like, grape plants and not just grape seeds. In fact, where do I get grape from? Of course you're not going to tell me. Green grape seeds. It's all grapefruit. Grapefruit. Okay, so there's cuisine grapefruit, and then there's the Pam's grapefruit, which I don't think really matter in this regard because of the fact that these grow on trees, they're just going to grow. Yeah, I don't see actual grape. There's grape seeds from Rustic. But those don't show me where they spawn. That's really unfortunate. Oh no, I'm fading. How awful. Actually, these are pretty dark. What is this? Plumps. 
Uh, can I do any... I couldn't really do anything with the grapes, because I think... Rustic grapes... I can ferment them. Oh, okay, so they do count. Let's take these back just in case. We can chuck... Either the extra boat... Here, how about this? We'll put the boat in the water, since we're gonna have to get out of here anyways. We'll leave the other boat here, like we did the last one. Because, whatever. And we'll grab some plums and get home. Because the more of these that we can kind of put... ...on our island... Yeah, I think that's about as much as that we're going to get from here. Yeah. These are forestry plums? Can I do anything with you? I can make plum juice and... Plum smoothies. Okay, I can just make the stone, make the seed, and then make a new one. Awesome. So we'll just eat one of these and then bring it back for further processing. I think it's time to head back. It wasn't what we were looking for, but our inventory is absolutely bursting. It's the middle of the night. It's just time to go home. Also, I love how zoomed, when it zoomed out, I'm like, where, where even am I? <laughs> yes, yeah, so we've got a little bit of ways to go. I think we got to go around here. So we may have to turn to the right a little bit. Plus, I think for the sake of the video, going more towards the coral would probably be a little bit nicer. If I can help it. I was hoping the hotkeys would zoom in and out the map. Oh well. Yeah, there we go. It'll be our last little calm, slow boat ride home. Yep, there's the other island. Which is that guy. Yeah, we'll just have to go through this channel. I don't want to go up this way. I don't know what's up here. We know there's water to the right, so we'll just go this way. Like, it could. It could be an island. I don't want to run the risk of that. Let's just go this way. Is that snow? It's probably all snow. There we go. There's some coral reef. I'll at least light it up the area for you guys. Plus, inadvertently, it gets rid of all of the, uh, <laughs> the kelp in our way. Yeah, it's just all snow. That's cool. Such a neat biome. It really is. Look at these little cliffs. There's even seahorses. There's some swordfish down there. That's such a neat biome. That's so cool. Okay, we've got more clay. I'm not going to come over here and dig it out, though. Okay, so that that was a little island. We were we could have been a little lucky with that, but I don't know any more of what these big boys are, and whether or not these bigger guys here are going to be a problem. Oh come on, it's not that cold. Is that spring water? Hang on a second. Is that all spring water coming down this mountainside? Because if it is, I could just sit in it and warm myself up. That's hilarious. What is this? It is. It's spring water. That's, that's so funny. Can 
Can I climb up this? With the boat? Yes, I can. <laughs> yeah, that's not supposed to be able to do this. <laughs> I would say this should be, like, warm. Oh, that's really funny. Yeah, we just have to kind of scooch on past here. Luckily, boats don't hurt us. Or, boats prevent us from taking fall damage, rather. Okay. Here, we'll just, we'll just row. If I do it this way, there we go. I know which direction we need to head in. It's literally up back through here. Are you fucking kidding me? What did I just throw? <sighs> Son of a bitch. I almost just want to go... There you are. Give. Thank you. God damn it. Good, I got saltwater bucket. Just, just empty it out, man. Empty it out. Empty the saltwater. Oh my god. This is what I get for putting the for fat fingering all of my keys all the time. Drop my water bucket. Freezing to death. I should have filled up on uh, the spring water, although it probably would have broken when I chucked it. Yeah, let's start heading back over a little bit to the east. Like, we'll have enough health, but that means I just need to eat much more when we get back. Well, next time. I'm gonna come back like, why the hell am I almost dead? <laughs> what did I do? Oh right, I'm an idiot. To be fair, I wouldn't have thought it would have been this cold this many different areas. Then again, it is fall. It is autumn. I should know this by now. It's a good thing I've eaten such a variety of stuff in my diet. Otherwise, I would never have... I overshot my island. What are you... Wait. Are you a fox? What are you doing out here? Get in the boat. Get in the boat. Alright, don't get in the boat. Fine. He didn't want to get in the boat, man. I can't help it if he doesn't want to get in the boat. And to be fair, it's a fox. They would eat all of our livestock. So... I tried. Yes, I... I, I wanted the friendo to come back to the island. It did not. Okay, oh my god. Whatever kicked you in the head kicked you hard. Thank you. Thank you, Jackalope Jones. Now as I slowly trudge all of this equipment back home. Put my plastic away. Put my iron and copper away. Where's the food? I'm so tired. Got back at morning. <laughs> I barely have energy to get into the house. Uh, put the special orange away. Should. I had regular plant fight. Fuck me. I don't need those. I really don't. Oh, 
Uh, where should I put the slime? Uh, melon slices. I should probably make one of these into seeds. One of them into seeds so I can make more later. Put these away. Put all of the excess fruit away. Oh, there's two pears. One's Pam's and one's Biomes of Plenty. One sucks. I guess I'm eating this one. Well, I can eat both, but... Actually, no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. This one is awful. Don't eat this one because I can make... Well, I can't make the pear sapling from this, but I can make the pear pip. Oh, can I only use the Pam's Harvest Craft one? Good thing I didn't eat that one. You didn't even made into a, into a seeds for, for things. <sighs> oh, wait, can I make this into fresh water? No. Darn. You, however... Oh, you can be made in that too. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. That's fine. I'll eat the good one. And then I'll take whatever one gets... I don't know which one the dynamic trees gives me. I, I wish I did. Uh, lemons, grapefruits, oranges... Ripe peppercorns. Too ripe for black pepper. Pick when they're still green. Oh, I didn't realize there was... Okay. Sesames we'll have to plant. Melons we'll have to plant. Grapes we'll have to plant. And all of these gardens, we'll take a look at what these do. One of you... ...has the blue milk caps, yeah. Peach. Plums. Okay. Now that we can do... I don't want to make anything with sesame in it. That's kind of the problem. There was something, if I do saturation... Ooh, I can do beep and bop. Eggs, raw beef, raw mutton. And it just takes veggies and eggs. Well, that's going to be good for me. I'll eat the General Tso's chicken first, though. Yeah. That should get me back up. Now I just need to sleep in the middle of the day before we get out of here. I'll do the gardens. And then I'll clean up anything that in the in the farmland isn't going to grow. Which means I need to bring out autumn plants. Been, it's been a grand old six hours. We could probably say that for next time, actually. Yeah, I think... <clears throat> the next things we need to do to progress... Honestly, are just going through our metallurgy. Getting our ore processing up to snuff with immersive engineering. And seeing if we can find green dye for greenhouse glass because if we can get greenhouse glass then we can grow things all year round if we can grow things all year round that means we can have a, a nice and varied diet which also means any anything in excess of over a stack in our fridge can basically be composted because i think you can compost things into either Oh, what does it use for? Does it does it use it as a bone meal? I think it does. I think you can take the compost that you make from it. Not you. You. It makes it into mulch. Yeah, and I believe if you take mulch, one, it makes it into biofuel, which we do need. 
for bio generators and everything else, which is really funny because I'm pretty sure burns organic material in the of the world to produce energy. I'm almost positive this thing takes biofuel and makes RF, meaning that eventually we'll be able to take all of our composted crops and make power out of it. But until then, we're going to want RF generation through this, which means we need creosote, copper, lead, iron, and redstone. We're going to need electrum, which is going to require uh, the refractoring the electrum mixture, which means we need to go find gold and silver. Uh, the kinetic dynamo here, we're going to need redstone, copper, and more and more iron and steel, and then iron place. Like, all of this is going to give us the portable generator. And that at least will allow us to burn up fuels to make RF. But it's going to be a while. Good old reliable palate cleansers. Okay, yeah, I think... Is it nighttime? It is nighttime. Perfect. And it's completely pitch black. Okay. That kind of that kind of settles of what I'm going to be doing. Also, you, you were down there. Why are you Why are both of you up here? You were down there. Whatever. I'm not going to question it. You guys can stay there. Okay, I think that'll about do it for me today.